Welcome to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. My name is the British Eagle, and today, as you can see, once again, we are back with another episode of Radiata Stories. And in the last episode, we uh, did quite a few things. And now, we're inside the Vancor recruitment area, whatever you want to call it. And I think we are going to switch out Grant for Dan. Now, it sounds like, based on the way I've said that, that I knew I was going to do that based on experience, even though this is a blind playthrough. And if you thought that, you would be correct. It is a blind playthrough, but I've done the first 10-15 minutes of this episode. Um, the emulator, like, completely screwed up for some reason, and when I walked through the path to another section, the whole game was black, and Jack was just walking on his own. I couldn't stop it from being an all black. There was nothing on the screen. Jack couldn't go to a new menu. He couldn't go anywhere. So the emulator just like, for some reason, for that one part of the game completely crashed. So I'm going to try this again. So we're going to add Dan to the team. Um, the reason why is because when I first tried to record this, I looked over Edgar and um, Grant's stats and their uh, abilities. Edgar has one more ability than Grant and also has better stats, is already level 11. Dan is a strong person that we can add to the team and might come in handy. I don't know much about him, so we'll see. Now, as far as missions go, we can't do anything right now. Thanos says he's got nothing for us. So in... Oh. I have some business to attend to. Private business. Um, if you don't mind. Okay. Well, thanks, Elwin. Um, so what I did... Um, actually, it's kind of a good thing that I ended up having to re-record this because my emulator just completely messing up there for some reason. Is because I'm pretty confident I know where to go to get a new mission for us to do. Now... I hope they're still in the same place. If they're not, then I have no idea what to do. But it should be here in this room. No. Um, it might be on the second floor now that I think about it. Let me check. Is it... Huh. Wait, was it this room? Maybe... Oh, man. Maybe because I had to restart in the time of day or whatever, they're not in this room anymore? Oh, no. That means I'm not going to be able to get the mission. or Because I got the mission by talking to one of the guys. Is it here? Might be on the second floor. No, they're not in the same spot as they were last time. All right. Well, um, then I can't do the mission I was going to do, I guess. That kind of stinks. I went in these rooms and basically went... Oh, this is it. I bet he's going... In... Yeah, he's going into this room and they're going to start having their discussion. So maybe I can go in here and get a... start this mission. What are you doing? You can't just waltz in here. What's the matter? Only authorized people are allowed in here. Okay, so I guess they're waiting on the last guy. Is he going to show up? Here he is. Oh, you. Can you do me a favor? Maybe. What do you want? Well, I'm in the Zwite Squad, okay? And our third anniversary is coming up. Hey, are you listening? Huh? Oh, yeah, I'm listening. Anyway, we're kind of thinking of getting our leader, Gerald, something. Ah, uh, there's this dwarf liquor they sell in Earth Valley. I'm with the deputy chief round the clock, so I can't get it myself. Can you go and pick some up for me? I'd really owe you one. Head straight to Earth Valley, okay? Yeah, so this is the mission I obtained in the last attempt to do this recording of this episode. There's no other missions that I'm aware of, and I think before we can progress the game, we have to do a mission like this. Otherwise, we're just kind of stuck. Um, so with our team and i think i'll show you guys just in case i didn't show you or i forgot to show you so dan has colossal power improves ability to knock down foes his attacks are downward swing a powerful downward swing with a hammer it deals great damage but is slow rotating spin a swing of his hammer causes little damage despite the weight of the hammer have a drink uses liquor to heal himself even the cheapest liquor works on him and the hiccups a hiccup is he drunk already so that's dan for you um, so that's kind of what we're working with. So, now that we have, um, done that, um, I am going to go this way. We're going to leave, go to a teleportation device, the pig teleporter, and we're going to go to the Earth Valley. Now, to get the liquor, um, and I, like I said, I only know this because I attempted to record this already. It's not because I know this game like the back of my hand. I don't, trust me. Um... But it's only because of the fact that I did this part already. Now, we are going to have to wait until it gets to 5 p.m. Or 
a later time in the afternoon for the bar to open up, and that's when they'll give us the liquor. So, right now, let me see what time it is. It is... Wow, it is 9 a.m., so <laughs> we've got a little bit of time to kill before we can come to the bar. So what I'm thinking is this. Um, I'm wondering if we can go talk... We should still talk to the guy in here. Because this is the original place where I thought we were supposed to get the liquor from. Hi. You have any dwarf liquor? You want me to sell you on dwarf liquor? No, no, no. Out to the question. You're too young. 21. Come back when you're 21. Let me try again. Hi. Not until you're 21, you hear? Alright, fine, whatever. Um, so yeah, luckily the time passes in this game relatively quickly, so we won't have to wait too long, but it does say Don Bay Diner, store hours 5pm to 2am, so we gotta wait a little bit. Um, what I might try and do in the meantime... I don't know why I keep going down here. I've done this every time I come to the city, and it's always a dead end. Um, what I might try and do is see if they have any weapons for us that we can buy. We've got a bunch more money. we got a butt ton of money now, so let's see if we can get anything new. Still Iron Edge, Air Blade, and Aqua Blade. Can I sell anything? Let's see if we can sell a weapon that we just don't need anymore. Um, we have empty bottles. I don't know why you would need that. Um... I'll sell the Aqua Blade. All right, I really... Well, actually, no. You know what? I'm going to hang on to that. Um, should I sell the empty bottle for 25 daggles? I'll hold on to that as well. You know what? I... Yeah, there's not really a... Not really much I can sell. Um, it's coming in. What I do want to check out really quick, which I didn't think about till now, is can I use this Book of Energy? Ah, we learned... There we go. I should have done this a couple episodes ago. Learned to use Vaulty. So now I can command my group to use those attacks or cure or, or things like that. So I'm going to try to do that a little bit more often now. Um, talk to the blacksmith in here. See if they have anything for us. Welcome. 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 Eagle Crest, Flea Ball, Startle Powder. Ah, they got the same stuff everyone else does. It's not really... Thank there's nothing special much. here. Okay, nothing nothing too crazy. So now that we've kind of done some stuff, I know it's not much. It is still 9 o'clock. All right, great. So let me see. What? Uh... All right, guys, then we'll have to come back, I guess. Um, I mean, I could cut to when it's 5 o'clock, but I, I really don't want to do that too often. Um, the time really shouldn't take that long to change. So what we'll do is... Um... We could always go to the elf region and try and get, um, try and get the, what's it called? Try and get some experience for our new team members. Um, yeah, let's do it. Why not? Let's get some experience for our new team members, and then we will come back, get the wine, and then we'll talk to our, uh, good old, good old pal that needs the wine for whatever he needs it for. Ooh, can we battle this? They won't let me in the city of flowers. I want to battle this crocodile. Oh, we're going to battle the flowers instead. Here we go. We got Dan on our side. Let's do it. They're really not that strong. These guys are pretty weak. Okay. We did it. Nice. See how much experience we get. I mean, it's probably better to fight here than the early... Earlier or closer locations to Radiata, so. A gob packing seed. Good experience, decent daggles, got an item. Not bad, but it is only the flowers. I want to see if there's a crocodile around here. Well, not the little guy there, but like a big sized one. Also, I love how Dan's just got a bottle of liquor. One more. Here we go. Get him. Protect the mage. All right. We did it. Nice job. More daggles. Let's see. 
400 experience. That's nice for weak uh, people like level 8 and 11 and stuff like that. Pretty solid. I just wanted to see if there were any good enemies here. Um... Really not seeing anything. I mean, okay, I guess we're kind of stuck there. We can't really go there. Um, huh. So I'm going to fight somebody. I mean, I thought that's why I came over this area to get some experience. Eh, there's this plant thing. That's fine. They're giving decent experience. We're just trying to kill some time so we can complete this mission anyway, so... The Petrify is so good. It literally means that we can just all attack without any issues at all. It's so nice. Such a good mage. I really appreciate him. He does a good job. And he heals too. And he can do all kinds of stuff. More. I mean, this is still better experience than the 50, 60, 70 we were getting before. So, not bad at all. Ooh, is this where we can find a croc crocodile? Or a crocagator? Oh, no. What? Oh, I just wanted to fight one of them. Come on. I would have been sick. Oh, wait. I found one. Let me fight him. Let me fight him. Let me fight him. Please, 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 please. Yes. Yes. Please be good experience. Please be good experience. And good to... Oh, there's, there's two big creatures. Nice. Crocodile. Wow, he's hanging on there. There. Oh. He's still... Oh, wow. He took a lot of hits. That should be decent experience. That should be good. Easy as pie. And Dan drinks. <laughs> nice. Wow. 13. We got Herb Extract DX. Level 9 for Dan. Level 12 for Edgar. Level 10 for Dan. Very nice. We got a good item out of that. Good experience. Good daggles. I'll take that. That was worth it. That was definitely worth that battle. All right. Let's head back this way. Uh, let's see. What time is it now? It usually goes by pretty fast in this game. It's almost 12, so we've got a little bit more that we can do. Um, I may end up having to just cut and let the game kind of speed up. I didn't want to do that, but... I just, I don't want to sit here and just grind. I mean, as, as helpful as it is, don't get me wrong, um, it, it, it might take a little while and I don't want to bore you guys. I do want to try and get to uh, completing this mission and then doing other stuff in this episode. So why don't we do that? I'm going to cut uh, this part out. So um, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, go ahead and pause it right here. I'm going to cut this part out. When it gets to the time where the bar is open, I'll... Uh, I'll cut to that part. We'll go to the bar in the Earth Valley. We'll get the liquor, head back, give it to the guy, and then hopefully new missions will become available for us. So I'll see you guys in a minute. I'll be right back. See you soon. Please work. Please, 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 please work. Okay, Dover region... All right, welcome back, everybody. Sorry about that. I had to cut real quick to get us to this point. As you can see, people are entering the bar, so that means we will be able to enter. Um, as far as my team goes, um, it may be a little bit different. Some things as far as money and experience. I had to redo this a third time. This emulator does not like me using the pig teleporter. I, I When I did the cut to wait for the timer, I was grinding in the elf... Or the, uh, elf the city flowers and I went to teleport back here once it got to the right time and it completely messed up again So I had to redo this for the third time, but we should be good. The levels are pretty similar Jack's now a little bit higher level 24 Dan's 10 Edgar's 13 um, We've got some items actually. Oh, I did do something when I was fighting the um when I was fighting the alligators in the city of flowers or outside the city of flowers We stumbled upon a weapon 
It's called the Aqua Sphere. It's really good, or at least it looks pretty good. Now, I'll let you guys let me know in the comments. I'll let you decide if we should use this. It has the additional bonus of freezing an enemy. It has a water element and has 29 strength versus the steel saber we have now is it, it puts us at 122 strength. So it's got 44, no element, no additional thing, and its CP is 6. Now, my personal opinion on it is that the steel saber, because it doesn't have an element, it's neutral. It's just neutral to everything. Whereas if you use an aqua spear, water could be resisted by some elements or it could be super strong. So there's there's a plus and a negative to it. Um, also, the additional freeze is nice. However, we already have the petrify from Edgar. So I'm kind of, I'm, for now, I'm going to use the steel saber. You guys let me know if I should use, um, if there's something, I'll, if I should use the aqua spear instead. Um, but you let me know. I'm fine with whatever. And then also, we came upon another berry, I think. I could have sworn we did. Maybe I'm wrong. Yes, we came upon a luck berry, which we're going to use for Jack. An evasion berry, which of course we're going to use for Jack, our star player. And now we're good to go. So let's talk to this guy right here. Hey, hey what do you want? Listen, I need to buy some of your dwarf liquor. What? You don't want to drink it, do you? No way! It's not for me! If it's dwarf liquor you want, I've got plenty. I'll give you some. Really? Thanks a lot! You don't drink too much. Now, don't drink too much. I said it wasn't for me. Sheesh. Alright, we obtained the dwarf liquor, so now we can finally head back. I'm hoping the game does not glitch on me. If it does, I'm gonna have to save and try to redo this again. Oh my gosh, it just does not like the pig teleporters. It really doesn't. Last time I came out through here, this exit right now, or the entrance, the teleporter didn't even show up. Okay, it's here this time. Thank God. Now, I'm going to do a quick save state because I do not want to have to do all this again over and over and over. So, I just did a save state. I'm going to do one more just to make sure this does not happen again and we should be good. So, even if this crashes, I can just reset it right here and we'll be good to go. So, let's head back to the Aiden region and let's go inside the Radiata main center city thing. And let's go give the liquor to that guy in the building. And hope that after we do that small little quest that we can finally get missions again from Thanos. That's kind of my goal right now is to obtain some mission or something. I don't know. Maybe in the story some new thing will happen. But we'll see. We'll see. Now I'm assuming at this point in time they may have gone home. But I'm going to check and see if they're in the room still chatting away. Um, was it the second or third floor? I don't honestly remember... No, it wasn't that room. Was it the room over here? No, I think it was upstairs. I think it was, yeah, it was the third room. That's the one with the flowers and the guy who's like keeping, keeping all the flowers nice and, well, flowerly. So I think it's this room. I'm hoping there is still in there. They're not. Okay, so we're probably going to have to rest up and wait for the next day unless I can find them. Maybe I can just go back in the streets and find them. I mean, that's what I did last time. Let me talk to Thanos real quick. Boo-hoo, nothing for you. All right, fine. So what time is it? It's almost 9, I think, that clock said. Oh, wait. Are you... Ah, oh, dang it. Let me go this way. This is how we bumped into him last time. Uh, there's star. No, I don't need star. Um, He's not walking along this alley or this street. Okay, let's go inside here. He usually is drinking or eating in here. So let's see if he's in this building. Is he upstairs? Come on. Oh, is this him? Uh, I think that's him, but he's drunk or asleep, so I can't do anything. The truth is I'm a little drunk. Great. So now I've got to sleep just to get him to wake up properly. Let me go back upstairs. Maybe, maybe when he's alone I can talk to him? Nope. I know that's the guy. I recognize the look, so now I've got to wait for him to sober up. Dang it. Ah. Uh, let me talk to this guy. Yeah. I'll tell you how I lost my eye someday. All right, boys and girls. So let's go ahead and get some sleep here. Um, we're going to go rest up. Once we rest up, tomorrow I should be able to give the guy the liquor. And then we'll get, I don't know, some bonus or reward or something. But let's go ahead and sleep. Let's hand back the, let's hand the liquor to the guy if we can go inside our house. And... Uh, We'll go from there. Sorry, this is kind of an all-over-the-place episode. It, it, there's so much has been happening. 
Um, between the game not saving and everything just kind of blacking out on my screen, I, I apologize, but we should be good moving forward. We should be fine, so we'll see. All right, so we're going to sleep, and it's daytime. There we go. Back in our bedroom, as always. And actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to save it real quick just to make sure that if anything happens, I can just load the file. So let's uh, let's save here, yes. Just in case, for some reason, it's just easier to do the load file. That's probably our best bet. So let's do that. All right. Now, let's go and talk to the guy. Hopefully, he's just walking the streets or something. I can find him relatively easily. Um... If not, then I'll check the building and see if he's in there, but let's see. First, I want to go down the street, see if he's down here walking around. Uh, let's see. She's walking around. Wasn't he following her last time, or he was back here? No? Okay, maybe not. All right, let's go head towards the... Uh, oh, is that him? It is. Perfect timing. This is it, right? That's it. That's it. Give it to me. So what about your promise? Promise? Yeah, well, if you ever need help, give me a shout. We added Gregory to our friends list. Very nice. All right, cool. So we might as well go back now, see what he's like as a character to, to use if we need him for combat or something. Um, so let's go see what... Uh, oh, come on. Really? You guys have to... Really? Really? I gotta wait for both of you to slowly open the door, let it close, so I can then go in. Thanks, guys. Alright, so let's talk to our good old friend Thanos after we check in our friends list. So let's see. Dan, we might replace Dan. Uh, what was his name? Gregory? Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. This is definitely him. Yeah, because we had Carlos, who's super low level. Gregory would be fantastic. Yeah, let's add Gregory. Holy crap, I was not expecting him to be that strong. Now his health is, is less than Alba, even though he's six levels higher, but his strength is 145. He's got really good evasiveness. He's got the best evasiveness on the team. He's got the best defense by a mile. Um, defense plus increases defense. Weak thrust, a quick spear thrust with emphasis on speed rather than power. Sweep Thrust, a large forward sweep with a spear, attacks all foes in front. And Power Thrust, a strong thrust with accumulated power. A twisting motion is added to the spear. I'll take it, dude. We've just got a powerhouse, and now Edgar's on our team. This is great. So there's still nothing for us. I find that interesting. So I wonder what we're supposed to do now. Like, I'll be honest with you guys. I really don't know where to go, so... We're going to just spend some time looking around, I guess. I mean, the only thing I can think of is that maybe we have to sleep for a couple days. Maybe that's what we have to do. Um, hey. Don't be shy. Okay, great. Yeah, I know you're Carlos. Hi. Good morning. It's polite to say hello. Makes folks feel more friendly, you know? Yeah, I'm surprised that he's got nothing for us. Let's go upstairs and just, like, talk to as many people as we can. See if we can find anyone who needs help in their team or... If anyone's got a mission for us, hmm, oh, it's you. I'm training. My work? Later, later. Okay, so he doesn't say or do anything. All right. Interesting. Yeah, sorry, guys. This might be a longer episode because I've got to cut out all the crap where everything reset and I had to take, I had to cut certain times and stuff. So this might be a long episode. All right, so. You guys don't do anything. I remember talking to the general before, and he didn't say anything either. Well, I've talked to you before, and you just talk about the flowers, so... Let's go upstairs. Let's go back into the third floor room. Let's see if they have anything else to say. Oh, no, he's here. What's the matter? Same thing. Can't just waltz in here. All right, well, I did. What are you going to do about it, bud? Nothing. That's what I thought. Um, man, I just don't know what there is to do, really. I mean, I feel like at this point, Thanos should give us another mission for something. Hello. But when the day of my victory does arrive, the name Star Eastern shall be emblazoned in the history books of Radiata for all eternity. You know what we could do? We could go back to Elysion. 
go back there and see if maybe there's a, a mission for us or someone wants to talk to us. Maybe that's what we got to do. I just really thought Thanos would have given us something, but I've checked all through this building and we've we've got our new friend. Who's this guy? Maybe I'm starved. I'm really starved. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, I mean, good news. We've recruited a crap ton of people. So let's see if we can go to Alaceon. Let me check where I'm at. Um, so yeah, I go this way. I'm pretty sure I know how to get there by now. Or I should at least. Um, what about in here? I haven't been in the the bar in a while. Talk to this guy. Hey. Look, look. Ah. Hey. Okay, so he's doing nothing. Great. All right, awesome. Awesome, awesome. I'm surprised we haven't ran into Gans at this point. I mentioned this a couple episodes ago, or maybe it was last episode, but we really haven't ran into him at all. He's just not shown up. He's just gone. Mm -hmm. What is wrong with you these days? You young people just don't do whatever you please. Do you ever think about other people? Oh, no, wait, wait. No, 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 no. <laughs> Jack, no, this way. All right, so let's head this way. I'm going to guess the Olaceon is where we can go. I honestly have no freaking idea. I don't know who we should talk to, where we should go. Um, let me see. Oh, no. Don't freeze again, game, please. Okay, thank God. Okay. What? Time for breakfast. Ah, uh, wait. Maybe it's lunchtime. I just woke up, you see? Uh, I get worried about this game crashing on me. It's done it a couple times already, so... Um, I guess we'll go... Uh, where the heck is Jarvis? I just haven't seen Jarvis in, like, a long time. Oh, wait. Hey. Confession is good for the soul, but you should do it nice and quiet. I mean, I don't really want to hear it, you know? Heck, I've ever heard confessions just walking around outside. Well, that's... that's something. So, let's check out some of these rooms again. I mean, maybe some new people are in them? No, that's Vita's room, or v Vitas's room. Vitas? 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 Uh, Dwight's in here. I don't like the little bitty work you have to do every day. I like those big one-off jobs that let you make a bundle at once. Let's talk to this this guy over here. They say the early bird catches the worm, but it'll take overtime pay over a worm any day. I'll take overtime pay over a worm any day is what they said, and I just butchered it completely. Uh, let's see. What the heck is this? Okay. Mm, great. There's just nothing to do with that. All right. Cool, cool. Great historical changes are afoot. We must all take care of the cho uh, the path we choose to take. We must all take care of the to choose the correct path. All right. Let's talk to some of the people. Hello. Oh, where's little Pooch? Where could he have gone? Um. All right. Ah, oh, man. I just... I don't know who to really talk to here. The sun is well up now. Everyone's going to start the herd hustling and bustling. Don't you have anything to do? If not, you should come to Olaceon. You might find your true calling. All right, I'll go inside with you. Yeah, go into Olaceon. I'll follow you. You then join us and become the best martial art artist on our team. It's weird that you can't walk behind them and, and go through the door. Okay, he's just trying to get us to go to church, basically, but, um, I'm trying to do some, like, missions or something. There's nothing here. Um, hmm. I'm almost wondering if what we should do is go to the castle, maybe? See if there's anything for us here? Oh, look, Clive. Hey there. If you ever want my help, you just let him a note. Yeah, let's go in the castle, if it'll let us. Oh, they do. I haven't been in the castle in forever. Yeah. If you want a job, just pick something from the postings. Hello there. This is the public employment office. Are you looking for a new job? Well, you guys kicked me out, so... I can't exactly get a job because you guys fired me, so... I didn't actually think I could come back inside here. Huh. I did not know I could do this. Well, should I explore, I guess? I, I mean... I didn't think I was even allowed in here. They fired me. Although, I'm not a knight anymore. I'll need permission to get inside the castle. Hello there. 
Well, how about washing dishes at a restaurant? Hmm. Yeah. Just pick something off the. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Okay, I'm just skipping through this. This is all just description. That's not a decent job, is it? Yeah, it's just labor. I mean, I thought we'd take one of these jobs. That's why I was like, oh, I'll just skip through the text and we'll take a job. Apparently not. Um, I guess there's really nothing to do in the castle then, I guess. I mean... Should we go this way? See if we can go in the front gates? I guess we can't go in the front gates. I might as well check around just to see who's around here walking and maybe I can talk to someone. They can give me a mission or something or... I'm trying to think of what else there is to do. Like, I feel like I'm missing something. Um, this is the northern entrance. The southern entrance is the other side. Yeah. Howdy. Uh. You may pass not... Rude. I wonder if guards get bored just standing around all day. That is a good question. I wonder if they do. I mean, I would. I'd be pretty bored. I don't know what you would do other than just standing there. Okay, so. I don't know what we should be doing, so I might try and just go sleep again. I feel like maybe I've just got to pass the time. Because I think there's only certain things you can do on certain, like... A certain amount of time has to pass before you can actually progress in this game, from what I understand. So, I'm wondering if that's the case. Then maybe I have to just, like, go to bed. <laughs> Something as simple as that, I guess. Um, I mean, I'm going to try it. it. It can't hurt to do that. So, let's go back to our house. Let's go ahead and sleep. I'm assuming then we'll have a mission or, or something to do. Um, I mean, we completed all the missions with Thanos. So, uh, yeah, let's go to sleep. Let's see if we can sleep and just progress the, the day. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Get a cutscene. Yuri. Mm -hmm. Jack, are you there? Who the heck is Yuri? Yeah, I don't remember. Here. You don't have to scream the door down. Thank goodness you're home. What's up? Did Sarge get all liquored up again? No, nothing like that. Just come, please. W what's wrong? It's Auntie Sheila. Something's happened. Huh? Miss Barbena went to cash a lottery ticket, but Auntie Sheila wouldn't give her the money. First, she started screaming at Miss Barbena, and then she started hitting her. Uh, so you're saying Auntie Sheila hit Miss Barbena, right? Yes, that's right. Will you just come, please? I don't really get it, but it sounds pretty bad. Okay, let's go. All right. Oh, what the heck? Yuri, my dear. Are you all right? Oh, oh I'm sorry. It's all right. Thank you, my dear. What's going on? Why did Auntie Sheila do this? I have no idea, darling. Hmm. It must be that illness that's been going around. Yes, yes. Why else would Sheila do such a terrible thing? Illness? Yes, her eyes were awful. Like some kind of wild beast. Hmm. Where did she go? She took the money, and then she ran home. Listen, will you take her to the Warrior Guild? Just tell them my name, and they'll look after you. But Jack... People with the disease... You don't know how violent they can be. Hey, don't worry. I'm on the case. Please, be careful, Jack. Just leave it to me. I mean, we've got Gregory on our team now. He's level 28 right off the bat, so I think okay. we'll be fine. So, is there a... Yes, there's a flag here. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. 
Why is there a flag here? Oh, I can save it here? Oh, that's kind of cool. I knew the flag saved, obviously, but I just was confused why they put one right there. Just seemed a little odd, but all right, we'll take it. We'll save it right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, I'll be honest. I I don't have time to waste. I have to go to Mishila's. Where is Mishila's though? Wouldn't it say it on the map? Mishila's. Who? I'm I'm not gonna lie. I don't. Did they mention it when they were talking? I must have missed the, the, uh, no, the guy, is it here? Oh. Who that, where is Michelle's place? Oh. What the heck? Oh. Okay, that's not Michelle's. No, let me get around the sign. Oh. Where is Michelle, is it just right here? Okay, that was ah weird. Okay. Miss Sheila, Miss Sheila, are you in there? Come on, open up. Hey, I said open up. If you don't, I'm gonna bust my way in. Right now, I'm mad. This is gonna be a Charlie Brown moment. Oh, I called it. As soon as he went to go run, knock down the door, she opened it. It's true. She's like a mad animal. Why did you beat up on Ms. Barbena? You know why. She tried to steal my money. She was the one who had the winning ticket. It was her money. I don't care whose it was. Even if it was hers, it's mine now. You can't just take other people's things. That's stealing. What's that? You want to steal my money too? Well, I won't let you. Ow! What did the general do here? Oh, right! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Well. That's over. Uh, no, it's not. Uh, okay, it's not over. Whew, that was close. There she is, over there. Are you all right? Yeah, no problema. Good, glad to hear it. No doubt about it. It's the disease, all right. Okay, let's get her to the castle right away. The castle? We've been ordered to bring all the afflicted townspeople to the castle so they can be quarantined. Is that right? Huh. Sorry, sir, if you'll excuse us. They work fast. Yeah, they got here quick. What a relief. I guess no one saw me miss with the karate chop. <laughs> nice. That would be a Jack thing. Ridley! We haven't seen her in forever. Oh my gosh. Is this really me? Or someone else? Come on, Ridley. Of course it's you. Uh oh. What the hell? What? Who's there? Was that was that my voice? Someone is inside me. Someone that isn't me. Interesting. I was not expecting all of that. Um, okay. 
Well, um, like I said, guys, because I've had to make so many cuts and stuff, I can't really tell how long this episode's been due to how much time I've put into the cuts and going back and forth and stuff. Oh, um, so what I'll probably do real quick is I do want to check and see if they've taken um, that woman to this building here. Let me see if I can find where... Well, let me talk to Thanos, see if he says anything. Oh, he does. Finally. Hey there, Jack. The Hecton Squad's been called up for an assignment. Oh, yeah? You'd better get out of your squad for a product. Okay. Good. We're all here. So, looks like we have a new assignment, boys. Our squad's been chosen to serve as bodyguards for a certain high-ranking member of the nobility. We'll be told who once we get there. But I want you all to be on your toes. Cool. High-ranking nobility. I wonder who it'll be. It must be one of the royals. I bet you anything. No way. That sounds pretty major. But Sarge, why did they ask for us? He sounds bigger than normal guild work. Knights attract too much attention. Vancor always handles these bodyguard assignments. Especially our squad. We don't stand out at all. No one notices us. <laughs> Oh, great. I think we know who to thank for that. Don't be careful. Yes, sir. That would be me, sir. <laughs> well, anyway, never mind that. We have to get going and meet the client. Roger. No, his name's Jarvis. Come on now, Jack. It's not Roger. Jeez. Party disbanded. Jarvis joins the party. Daniel joins your party. Very nice. A cutscene to end the episode. Very nice. I like this. Sorry to keep you waiting, sir. I am Sergeant Jarvis of the Hecton Squad. It's quite all right, Sergeant. Thank you for coming. My name is Raymond. And this young lady is Val... That is to say... Please, call me Arnold. What? We're calling you Arnold? Okay. Ladyship. Oh, of course. Sorry. We're the princess's security detail? That is so cool. But what kind of alias is Arnold? I mean, couldn't they come up with anything better? That's what I was thinking. That's why I was like, Arnold? Really? I think it's a really great name. Why, thank you very much. My name is Daniel. <laughs> and I'm Jack Russell. I'm the best sword fighter in town. Oh my, what a perfect escort. He's my subordinate. Hey, I'm the corporal. Oh, forget it. <laughs> As you can probably tell, he's kind of a loser. Daniel, what the hell? Oh, Dude, enough. you're being mean. You're starting to push your luck. Enough, we're on duty. <laughs> I haven't been out of the castle in ages. Uh oh, wait for us. Her ladyship will be in safe hands. Please take very good care. All right, we got to escort a princess, I mean Arnold, to so, some place. Well, first I want to see the accessories at OK Hand in Maid's Town. Are we going to all the shops? Hey, don't be so cheeky. We're supposed to be undercover, right? So what? That doesn't mean you're allowed to be rude. Listen, Pipsqueak. Hey, cut it off. Come on, we have to hurry before all the shops close. Wait, Miss Arnold! Huh? Where'd she go? Miss Arnold! Damn it, where is she? There, there she is, Sarge! Help! It's the Are you guys serious? Oh my gosh. All right, guys. Well, we're going to save it right there. Thank you guys so much for the support on this episode. I, again, don't know how long this episode's going to be. The timer says an hour and seven minutes, but I'm going to have to cut so much out that it could be 40 minutes. It could be 25 
55, who knows, but thank you guys so much for the support. In the next episode, we gotta go save this princess. I mean, Arnold, just a regular person, but we gotta go take care or save them from the bandits who just stole her around the corner. Once we save her, we'll continue with the rest of the story, but I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Continue to spread those positive vibes. Hit the like button down below. Let me know how you're enjoying the series so far, what you like about this game, and who your favorite character is so far, and I will catch you guys in the next episode, but until next time, I'm out. Peace.